Hey everyone, welcome back to the Declarative Academy. If you're new here, I'm glad you found us. This channel is all about helping you build smarter, faster Salesforce solutions, no code required. Whether you're prepping for your admin cert or just want to sharpen your day-to-day -day org skills, you're in the right place. In this video, we're picking up where we left off. You built a service console. Now it's time to customize your Lightning Service Console pages so your support team gets the right tools right where they need them. Here's what we're going to cover. Create a custom Lightning case record page using the Lightning App Builder add. Key components like knowledge, chatter, and related lists. Customize the highlights panel to surface essential case details. Assign your new layout to your console app and test it out. By the end, you'll have a clean, efficient page layout built for real-world support work. Let's jump in. Let's check back in with Ada Balewa, our product support specialist at Ursa Major Solar. Her team works hard to manage a steady stream of customer cases. And now she's looking for a cleaner, smarter layout that brings everything they need into one screen. What does Ada have in mind? She wants a highlights panel that shows key case info at a glance, a knowledge section that gives quick access to helpful articles, related lists that link accounts and contacts without extra clicks, and a live chatter feed so her team can collaborate in real time. To make that happen, we'll build a custom case page using the Lightning App Builder. Here's how to get started. First, Click the gear icon in the top right and select Service Setup. In the Quick Find box, type Lightning App Builder, then click to open it. Click New, then choose Record Page. On the next screen, fill in the details. Set the label to Case Console Record Page and choose Case as the object. Click Next, then select the pinned header template. This keeps the top section visible as you scroll. Click Done to enter the builder. And just like that, we're ready to start designing a layout that puts Ada's vision into action. Now it's time to bring Ada's vision to life by adding all the components she needs. Start by dragging the highlights panel into the pinned region at the top. This will keep key case info front and center at all times. Next, move to the left side of the screen and drag in an accordion component. Inside the accordion, drag details above related to organize the content clearly. Now, let's configure the details section. From the drop-down, select Knowledge. This ties the section to helpful articles relevant to the case. Then, expand the Knowledge section and drag in the Knowledge component itself. Move on to the Related section and drag in the Related List component. This will link accounts, contacts, and other related records without any extra clicks. In the center region, drop in the record detail component so agents can see all the case data in one place. Finally, on the right-hand side, drag in Chatter to enable real-time collaboration across the team. And that's it. You now have a complete, streamlined layout with all the essentials, highlights panel, knowledge, related lists, record detail, and Chatter, all visible at once, all working together. Let's go ahead and save the page then activate it so Ada and her team can put it to work. To bring your custom case page to life, start by clicking Save, then hit Activate. Next, head to the Org Default tab. Select Assign as Org Default, click Next, and then Save. Now, click Activation again, but this time switch over to the App, Record Type, and Profiles tab. This is where the magic happens. From the drop-downs, Assign App Ursa Major Solar Service Console Record Type Master Profiles Custom Support Profile and System Administrator Click the through the prompts and make sure to hit Save. And just like that, your custom case page is live and ready for testing. Let's test it. Open the Ursa Major Solar Service Console app. Click into any case record. Check that all the new components are in place just like you set them up. If everything looks good, you're ready for one last improvement. 
updating that highlights panel. Ada wants quick access to key details like the account name, case owner, and date time opened right at the top of every case record. To make that happen, we'll create a custom compact layout tailored just for her. Here's how to do it. Start by clicking the gear icon and going to service setup. Then head into the object manager. In the search bar, type case and select it from the list. On the case setup page, click compact layouts. Next, click on system default. Then hit clone to create your own version. Give it a name that makes sense, Ursa Major Highlights Panel. Now it's time to choose the fields. In the available fields list, hold down Ctrl or Command and select account name, case owner, date, time opened. Go ahead and move those fields into the selected fields list. And while you're at it, make sure to include these essentials as well. Subject priority status, case number. Once everything's in place, click save to lock it in. Last step, assign your layout. Go to compact layout assignment, click edit assignment, and set the primary compact layout to Ursa major highlights panel. Click save and you're done. Now, Ada has a clean, personalized view with the most important case details, front and center, making her day just a little bit easier. Key takeaways while you verify steps. We looked at custom record pages, give your agents a focused, easy to use layout. Adding knowledge, chatter, and related lists puts everything in one place. Compact layouts let you control what shows in the highlights panel. In just a few clicks, you've made the console a whole lot smarter. If this tutorial helped you streamline your console, give it a like and drop a comment to let us know what else you'd like to customize. And don't forget to subscribe so you never miss a Salesforce tip from the Declarative Academy. Thanks for watching, and as always, keep it declarative. See you next time.